That squirrel was hugging the branch pretty well. It's a nice size one. It's getting harder to spot now because the trees are starting to come into bud. best way I've found so far is just having a little walk up and down the shelter belts and just stopping ever so often next to a tree listening and just seeing if you can spot them because that's what I'm doing this evening like normal shooting a few pigeons for a friend but also taking out squirrels I've got the 410 with me and my dad is actually stood at the top and he's got his 12 ball, um, got his Franchi auto tonight. We are out quite early because obviously he's still got a bit of sun sunlight left. It's about half past five, so I say a couple of hours of light left. But there was a few bits, a few bits around. I have seen a couple of squirrels, but they've eluded us in holes. But yeah, the pigeon side of it, um, we've got his wheat in front of us and some drilling which runs down the side there. So we are more just taking the crows and pigeons as they come on and off the field. And we can't decoy this part of the land because there is some footpaths that run on the far side and that's mainly where they're feeding. So as you've seen in a few of my videos, We've always opted just to stand in the shelter belts or walking around. So I'll stand there for a minute or two, see if I can get anything in this clearing. Well, I've decided to have a walk around and I left my dad in the shelter belt. Um, where he was stood, it was quite quiet, but I could still see a few pigeons and crows. But because I had the 410, I just didn't want to push my luck with them but when I've been walking around there's been a load of pigeons just come off of these trees my dad's just had a shot I'm just going to say because a load of pigeons have come out of these trees that have come off the uh, crops on this side and quite a few went back down to that shelter belt but I can see them all moving now from that shot but it's quite frustrating because we haven't really got that long I think I just missed that one. Yeah, I say we haven't got that long really out. But you never know, moving around like this, might get a shot at a couple more. Oh God, that's us about done for the day now. Um, we're going to shoot off. I am just making my way back now to the wood my dad's in. I don't know what he's got, but I've heard him have four shots. It could be them pigeons that I put over him. I don't know. Um, I've had no more shots since that pigeon that I missed. So, it's not a very exciting video, but hey-ho, that's the way shooting goes. I'll put it on how it is. Sometimes we have good days, sometimes we have bad. But um, there is a new addition to the team that you'll be meeting soon. Got myself a gun dog. So I'll do a little video about her in the next couple of days. But yeah, I'm just going to go back now, see what he's got. And if he's got anything, I'll put a picture up for you guys. But anyway, I'll see you soon. And we're going to be out on another patch of ground actually from more pigeon shooting.